Alright guys, this is a quick little video about how I set up my three-way zero block. So to show it is not zeroed, I can go ahead and move the machine a little bit in either direction. As long as you have it close to the zero and about um, an inch high, um, you're good to go. What I'm going to do is hit reset zero on universal G-code send there. Um, on my macro, I have a really long string of code where it does a bunch of different things, but I will hit the macro button. For it to start, and actually let me jog that up a little bit, and then uh, it will do its thing and zero all the way down to the corner. Okay, once it does that, uh, now we know it's done, and what we can do is if I hit, I'm trying to get it to focus here, if I hit on Universal G-Code Sender to return to zero, it actually zeroes itself out on the very corner, and notice it's on the very corner of both directions and the Z is set dead on. Um, so that should be good for uh, repeatability and accuracy. So if you have to do bit changes or anything like that, um, it works out good. And I just machined this piece out of some aluminum stock that I had. Um, and it's just a little square with a little rounded out corner. So that way uh, it can fit over a sharp corner. Uh, nice and easy, but uh, yeah, cool. I just figured I'd share. Thanks.